पहले मुझे बताओ आप में से कितनों ने एक्चुअली माड़गांव एक्सप्रेस में ट्रैवल किया सो अच्छा आप भी जी जी मैंने मुंबई टू गोवा ट्रेन में ट्रैवल किया है नॉट श्योर वो मडगांव एक्सप्रेस थी या कोई और थी बट बाय ट्रेन किया रात में दिन में थी रात में से दिन में निकला था नहीं रात में नहीं निकला था दिन में निकला उससे पहले तक लाइफ बिल्कुल सही चल रही थी द मोमेंट वी सॉ दैट कार एंड थ्री फ्रेंड सडनली देर वॉज अ फोम ये नहीं किया यार ये करना चाहिए सो यू शुड नो दिस ऑन द वे बैक वर ऑल द दिल चाहता है टाइटल ट्रैक सॉन्ग वो शॉर्ट इन द कार एक्चुअली so we were driving back stopping shooting then we stayed in uh, overnight super and then again uh, dil chahta yeah, hai yeah. change wow. the whole concept of rides boys you know hanging out together yeah. and goa but i want to ask if the dil chahta hai three sum were to meet these three fir kya hoga will be the sequel to both <laughs> <laughs> it would be actually interesting yeah. Yeah. it would be nice to meet our seniors yeah. you know who started it all yeah. 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 Tum, tumne kya kiya aur humne like kya kiya master teach me kung fu <laughs> I, can, i can call it bachpan ke sapne mil gaye apne oh, oh. Hey, wow. that you have your sequel let's do it yeah, dono excel ki hain why not to aapka to goa ke sath ek hai na go goa gaon ke kya 10 saal hue aapne socha fir se goa देखिए मैं गोवा ना एक्चुअली मेरे को लगता है लकी चाम सही है क्योंकि पहले तो इतनी ख्वाहिश थी जाने की जा नहीं पाए फिर जब गए तो टच वुड हमेशा अच्छी मेमोरीज रही चाहे वो काम पे हो चाहे हॉलिडे पे हो फैमिली के साथ हो दोस्तों के साथ हो को एक्टर्स के साथ हो या फिर इस फिल्म की जब हम प्री प्रोडक्शन के लिए गए जब इस फिल्म का पूरा एक्सपीरियंस वहाँ पर हमेशा बहुत अच्छा रहा वहाँ के लोग वहाँ के वहाँ का खाना और वहाँ की जो पूरी वाइब है ना तो सब पॉजिटिव ही रहा तो आई थिंक आई रियली बिलीव दैट इट इज़ अ लकी चार्म इन माय लाइफ एंड व्हाई नॉट आई आई विल कीप वर्किंग इन गोवा सो आई वाज हियरिंग वन इंटरव्यू ऑफिस एंड बाय द हिज टीम ऑफ गो गोवा गोवान सेड ही वाज द ओनली वन हु केम प्रिपेयर्ड फॉर दैट शूट विद एवरीथिंग वाइल अदर्स डिन नो वॉट वॉज हैपनिंग सो वर यू ऑल्सो प्रिपेयर दिस टाइम अराउंड वैन यू हैड द थ्री मस्कीटियर्स अलॉन्ग विद यू येस बट दैट प्रेपरेशन वॉज डिफरेंट दैर वे टॉकिंग अबाउट सो आई हैड I knew that this shoot is going to be grueling. It will go on for a very long time. I don't know where they'll go because they're like going, either करते हैं उधर करते हैं. तो मैंने ना उसमें जब हम rave party में जाते हैं, तो मैं एक ही था जिसने एक bag रखा था. और वो bag मेरा portly baba की बन गया. उसमें से कुछ भी निकलता था. मुझे टोपी चाहिए निकल गई बीच पिक्चर में. मुझे continuity में इतने थक गया t-shirt बन गई t-shirt निकल गई. बाकियों के पास थी नहीं. So वो literally i made sure that i was completely prepared for at least everything that is planned for and then there are things that are not planned and they happen <laughs> i'm very happy that i was able to adapt and kind of uh, you know take decisions on the go and change things to fit the narrative and you know make sure that we still have a film that everybody enjoys but he gave it, a portly to everyone this time <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but you know there's never been a film where you can tell anybody i've heard them say that it went exactly the way yeah. i planned it yeah, absolutely but that's the beauty of beauty. what we yeah. do right yeah, exactly. yeah of it's, course schedules falling apart actors ne thank kiya first time director ko bilkul nahi nahi na yeah bilkul nahi bilkul bhai 22 march ko picture aa rahi hai isko baat kar but kunal i mean or i after I, yeah, before i come to them it's an interesting journey you started as a child artist then you know headlining shows and now direct So I mean, it's pretty interesting. Madagawa Express, just like adventurous, sir. Yes, I think it's never been in my blood to give up, uh, or you know, feel that. I I mean, I I've been uh, in my own way. Sometimes I'll crib about the fact that why is this is not good, and I'm feeling this negativity. But I always feel that if if the opportunities that are coming your way are not to your standards, then you have to do something about it. And I think with Madagawa Express, I kind of created a new opportunity for myself. I wasn't aware that I was going to be a, a director on this film but definitely as a writer and I hope that maybe if it gets made I'll play one of the parts so as an actor I was trying to create that opportunity for me I think I was rewarded in a much better way uh, thanks to Excel Entertainment who kind of after hearing the script allowed me actually offered me before they even allowed me to be a director on this one and uh, and I'm very thankful to them for having done that because I don't think I would have courage enough to kind of say that you know I've written this also 
I'm hoping to act in this also. But also, by the way, I want to direct it. <laughs> so you know, there's so many things that uh, you don't know, and and firstly, you don't even know if this is something that they'll connect with or they'll vibe with and they'll want to make. But I'm very happy that it all paid off in in a way that I did get to make this exactly the way that I imagined it. Or I wrote it. I got to cast the people that I wanted to work with. I got to get the uh, technical crew that I wanted to work with, and I'm very thankful to the producers who stuck to their guns of saying what they said the very first day when they heard it was, "This is a film that you want to watch with your friends. This is a community watching experience. This has to release in the theaters, and it does not matter who is in the film now or what happens." That's awesome. And both of you are coming after two very intense, mm, mm. you know, narratives. So was yeah. this like liberating suddenly? Yeah. सब कुछ या डेफिनेटली लिबरेटिंग बट ऑल्सो यू नो वॉट आई आई इंजॉय कॉमेडीज बट आई एम ऑलवेज वेरी फियरफुल ऑफ कॉमेडीज बिकॉज इट्स योर ऑन योर ओन या मैम इट्स इट्स लाइक नो बैकग्राउंड स्कोर नो स्पेशल कैमरा एंगल कैन सेव यू यू गो आउट देयर यू परफॉर्म एंड यू आर नॉट जस्ट ऑन योर ओन यू हैव अ टीम ऑफ एक्टर्स यू ऑल हैव टू कोलेबोरेट एंड यू बेटर कोलेबोरेट ऑन इट सो इट्स इट्स एक्चुअली इट्स अ लॉर्ड ऑफ होमवर्क एंड हार्ड वर्क वेन इट कम्स टू कॉमेडीज so i'm always very very mindful of the fact ke okay comedy hai maza bada aayega kyunki kuch aisi serious baat nahi hai but the process of making it is 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 you have to be very very there alert every day yeah. every second what do you do when the jokes fall flat apne apni taraf se to bahut acha kar raha hai magar aapka jisko react karna ho is just standing like that aisa kabhi hua hai thankfully aise yeah uh, no you have to cast better say. actors <laughs> yeah. you who, who, who react even if it falls flat <laughs> yeah but you, what definitely happens is you don't know if it's landed yeah you know uh, that's one conversation that we would sit down and okay bahut raha hai kya ja raha hai kya is it going in that direction mm. and then you only trust kunal because he's someone who's who knows it all he he really has some clarity mm. uh and some as in all the clarity that's possible <laughs> with this film very honestly because he knew everything hmm. he knew how kya pitch hona chahiye kya nahi hona chahiye kiska kitna pitch hona chahiye kaun kis tarah se dikhega kaun kis tarah ke kapde pehnega everything was very very clear so it only becomes your job only becomes much more easier and with with the cast that we have uh thankfully you just have to be present i i truly believe that if you're just present uh listening to your co-actors and responding well hmm. i think most of your job was done by the script but konal what was it like directing it because i know somewhere the actor in you also would have been like you know they might may do it differently but you were like no maybe this is the tone maybe this is the way they should did that conflict happen no actually i also uh, blessed to have very sensible actors who kind of see that's why a lot of uh, prep happens before you go on to set it's not like you're going on to set and oh hmm. surprise surprise hmm. whatever i've done so you have a lot of those conversations you read the scripts Uh, we had a couple of readings i don't believe in doing workshops of blocking and acting but i did want them to spend time with each other because comedy and especially if you're doing three friends the chemistry is going to work yeah. and you know you want them to be f- like aware of each other's temperaments mm. so that they don't second guess if they if they instinctively feel that i want to push him in this or you know like ruffle his hair up you don't want to be on the other side saying that this actor might get offended or you don't want to be that actor saying are you know when you did that i kind of you just spoiled my अच्छा Uh, the kind of pants that you wear will decide how high you can kick or how fast you can run sure. in those. So that's why all of those things were important for them to kind of vibe off each other. But like I said, I had these amazingly versatile actors who kind of took to it like they were meant to play these parts. And my job as a director then beca- then became to okay, this is happening. Now let me figure out the technical details in this scene. Wow. Fun trivia, I tell you. Ha, batao. Mm. Divyendu plays Dodo. Saari mein Pratik, bahut sundar lag rahe hain aap. Thank you. Pratik plays uh, Pinku. and his name is pratik actually in the film ha and avinash plays ayush yeah. d d p p a a and it the characters were written before the yeah, casting yeah before right? before so casting so you were meant to be yeah looks like and in the sari also you just had someone who <laughs> thank you thank of you all of us really actually well. can learn the <laughs> grace from divyendra yeah. now yeah. <laughs> but uh now i'm going to ask ritesh and then come to you ritesh i mean the knack for picking up stories how does it happen in your 
I mean, is I he a difficult producer to convince? Not at all, actually. Okay. Uh, to convince? Yeah. That not. I mean, I can only speak about this film. I think uh, he convinced me to be a director more than I convinced <laughs> him to like say make this film. Yeah, he didn't want to direct it, actually. So it was um, no. But I think um, the, the of picking a script. I think on some level, any of the work you see, like of which you, I mean, which we've done, and lent our voice to, and collaborated with the writer or director is always been that you believe in whatever that story is. Like there is a 100% belief in saying that story and you identify with it, there is an emotional connect. So I think that forms the basis of anything you do. I mean, whatever the genre is irrespective. I think somewhere you start believing when you're reading it or you're hearing the narration that, okay, I believe in this, this seems real. And you know that those characters exist. You know, you would have crossed paths with one of those characters. So if, as long as somewhere in it, especially in the lead, the protagonist part of it, you start resonating with it and identifying with it, that's when you know that, okay, I want to go ahead and make this, you know. Do you do the math also? Because producers are usually like math, numbers and I all. I think, no? you know, if you do math, don't make films. You should never do films. And I've that's said like it a in a person. lot of, a lot of ways. In fact, I just said the same thing last week. I was, they were screening at a, in a LA hmm. at the School of Cinematic Arts, which is the number one film school in the world. They screened Gully Boy, right? And then they did a Q&A with these 200, 300 students, all film students. And this thing came up on one of them because they have this program called the Business of Cinema. Yeah. So I said, I don't understand what it is because if you want to do business, do something where there's a given. There's everything not given in ah. filmmaking. Mm -hmm. Everything is unpredictable. Ah. You may have the best director, you may have the best writer, you may have the best characters, but it might not connect and you, there is no second chance. Once it's out there on a Friday, it's done. Absolutely. You can't do it. So I think if you start doing numbers, you can't make Of course, you'll be conscious about what the film requires and you do the best for what it it requires and then you have a strong team which tells you, okay, make it thinking if it's going to only hit this much. You know, then if it goes over and above that, you can't think every movie is going to break the box office. You have to be smart yeah. about it. Which is true. And you both know that you had a character with your characters, that there was a vibe. It was very crazy. My character was very crazy. It was very crazy. It was very crazy. It was very crazy. It was very crazy. Yeah. It's... I mean, it's like something उसको आपको दूर से देखने में बहुत मजा आएगा उस कैरेक्टर को आप उस जैसा नहीं बनना चाहेंगे। पर वो आपके सारे कैरेक्टर्स के साथ होता है वैसे देखा जाए थोड़ा वो क्रेजीनेस। हम्म हो सकता है या डेफिनेटली या। नहीं सॉरी आई इंटरप्रेटेड। हाँ कहाँ से आती है? हाँ ये कहाँ चलो। I think that I a director has कि दिव्यंदु है जो कि सिर्फ दिव्यंदु ही कर सकता है। That I like that. I like that. There is there and he is like a reservoir like ये button push करते हैं ये वाला ये करते हैं इस वाले। No but that's the fun of it right? I mean when you do something which is completely out of the world and you know especially this character Dodo I kept on asking Kunal dude सुर ठीक है ना ये बहुत ऊपर है ये बहुत ऊपर है ये बहुत ऊपर है and he was like don't worry मैं बैठा हूँ so whatever we did we did consistently. So, but, but yeah, it wasn't easy for me to pull this off. It, it was a quite a tricky character. You know, the vibe I got from the trailer was like, you have Dil Chata, the first thing about Goa, then you have Hangover Putin, then you have Gulmal Putin. It's like a comedy. You're just laughing because at the enormity of the situations that they're just like, keep on finding themselves. Yeah. Yeah. Are you anything like your character? Like, press karo to trouble. Here uh, comes trouble. Ne, uh, unfortunately, uh, fortunately, I would say, ki <laughs> इस फिल्म में जो हो रहा है वो जिंदगी में तो ना ही हो किसी के और ना ही होना चाहिए बट मेरा रिजन सिर्फ इस चीज से था कि जैसे ये इनके जो दो दोस्त हैं माय कैरेक्टर इस मोर स्ट्रेट जैकेटेड अमंग्स द थ्री ऑफ देम एंड हेंस यू यू विल सी कि मुझे हमेशा ऐसा लगता था कि जो ये सेट पर वाइब होती थी uh, holding on to that and uh, controlling that was the biggest trouble for me. So initially, जो दो तीन चार दिन हैं जब हम ये कर रहे थे, वो तीन चार दिन मुझे लगे अपने आप को वापस कंट्रोल करने के लिए कि this is not how you are supposed to be. And uh, I think once that came through, uh, Kunal guiding me through the way, I think once that came through, it became much more easier. All of them are really praising you, Bichar Ari, 22nd Co. Where did you tell me about it? He did a different interview. He came out of 22. He came out of 22. How can someone say to someone? This would be interesting. I have to say something.
<laughs> थोड़ा सा बता दो थोड़ा सा स्पाइसी कर देंगे सीरियसली ऐसा कुछ भी नहीं आई मीन इज जस्ट जो पेनफुली क्लियर अबाउट हिज विजन ऑनेस्टली मतलब कभी दिखता ही नहीं था दैट ही इज अनश्योर और ही डजेंट नो इट्स लाइक ऑलवेज ये करना है इतना है करना है हो गया कुछ और कर दूं वो भी नहीं करना है <laughs> ये भी नहीं करना है एक वो दे दूं नहीं इतना यही चाहिए इट्स लाइक ओके ठीक है बॉस मतलब ये भी नहीं कि एक इनसिक्योरिटी होती कि एक और ले लूं क्या सेफ्टी या आई डोंट नो इफ शुड आई टेक अ वेरिएशन ही वाज एब्सोल्युटली क्लियर ही गॉट द टेक या मूव ऑन नो आल्सो आई मीन बिकॉज़ ही इज एन एक्टर हिमसेल्फ तो दैट सेव्ड अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम फॉर अस Like you know, after the cut, if you feel something and you're like Kunal, मुझे वो is like आह मैं समझ गया. या after the cut, Kunal says Divyendu, वो थोड़ा सा तू वो क्या रहा है कि आह ठीक है हो गया. So that used to happen. Like the communication happened really well. That Kunal, do you think really actually helped being an actor, being on this side and then going on that side, understanding it? I think so. I think you know all the directors that I worked with, right from my childhood, and they've been all different types of directors. I think somewhere they've been my teachers. uh and subconsciously everything that i was learning and imbibing and understanding and watching them work uh has kind of gone into me being an actor of a certain uh, kind and similarly being a creative mind yeah. uh you know like when it comes to comedy i've had the opportunity to work with like a priya darshan or rohit shetty or raj dk uh i'm sorry if i'm forgetting anybody but like these great minds who have different styles of storytelling like priyan is great with putting 15 people together and creating something mad energy wise and you know it still works rohit shoots it beautifully yeah. he shoots comedies like big films uh and and then rajan dk who do something subtle uh, okay. and throw away lines which are you know they're not creating humor in the way that we've seen before so all of those learnings have been kind of inspirational for me and i i I'm not that i've tried to emulate it i think if you could emulate it then we would have lots of priya darshans lots of rohit shetties and yeah. lots of rajan dk's but i think uh, i've i've maybe it kind of reflects in my style of writing or film making when people see this film so now we'll have a kunal khemu brand of comedy mm-hmm. and uh, lastly before we go since goa is a character mm-hmm. is picture ke baad ab goa ja ke ek cheez aap bilkul nahi karenge aur ek cheez aap zarur karenge lessons learned i mean they say now whatever happens in goa stays in goa mm-hmm. but now i'm asking you one thing that you guys will never do ho gaya bas i think waisi party nahi kar sakte वो अब होता नहीं है थकान हो जाती है वो अब लाउड म्यूजिक में अभी वो तो वैसा हो गया जनरली कि यू वॉन्ट हैव कॉन्वर्जेशन नो लॉन्गर आई यू सेंग ना आउट जस्ट गो एंड डांस डोंट टॉक टू मी यू लाइक आई रियली वॉन्ट हैव कॉन्वर्जेशन विद पीपल आई डांस फॉर टेन मिनट्स एंड लेट जस्ट चैट तो वो हो गया uh, और जो करेंगे वो गोवा फिर से जाएंगे बिकॉज आई थिंक गोवा हर मूड को सूट करता है हर तरह की ट्रैवल ट्रिप को सूट करता है चाहे आप दोस्तों के साथ जाएं चाहे आप बच्चों के साथ जाएं फैमिली के साथ जाएं या अकेले जाएं देर समथिंग टू डू जैसे कि हमारी फिल्म मडगांव एक्सप्रेस जैसे ही गोवा गोवा नाउ इट्स नॉट नेसेसरी दैट एवरी टाइम आई गो आई गो टू द बीच ऑनेस्टली so it's actually uh, you know chilling with your friends at a villa you know going to new restaurants trying out new cuisines you know some new chef is there some new cocktail guy is there it's more of that so uh, goa has many many facets to it aur aapka waise trains ke sath bhi kuch lagta hai bahut gehra na aata hai yaar railway mein madgaon express yeah गाड़ी बुला रही है city bazaar achi chal rahi hai gaadi touch hota hai chalni chahiye aise haan ji aap batao ji goa ke मुझे भी लगता है कि सारे दोस्त जाकर एक ए, एक जगह मिलती है जो आप सारे अपना काम धाम छोड़कर आप आप भी हैं। ऐसे चुप रहते हैं नहीं नहीं मैं मतलब जब दोस्तों के साथ फिल्म फिल्म में फिल्मों में देख ले <laughs> फिल्म में मौका मिलेगा देखने का थैंक यू सो मच सो आई मीन विल बी गेट दिल चाहता है And see, we have to rise up to the occasion, right? Yeah. I mean, Dil Chata is a yeah, cult yeah. classic. Huh. For that, we have to become a cult classic. Yeah. Yeah. Only then it it will make a good cocktail. Chalo, fingers crossed. So, see, see, then we will get a Dil Chata. Hai, meet Madgaon Express. That will be pretty interesting, though. Thank you <laughs> so, so much. Dil Chata is that Madgaon Express. It will go. It will go. It will go. On that note, all Thank the very best and many congratulations once Thank again. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. If you've liked this interview, please like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram.